What's up my welding people from YouTube? This is Captain Money and today we're gonna be doing slip on flanges. That's right. Slip on flanges are cheap flanges compared to walnut flanges. And we're gonna show you how to fit them right here. We're using a carpenter square and a L square. Once it's like perfect hundred percent you can see here yep they just sleep on you know but I know I never walked this sleep on before so I did some search call some friends you know and then you can use 7018 you can take you can use you can even use 6 to 10 but 7018 is probably better so we're gonna tack it on the top like I just saw right now and then tuck it on the bottom. He turned around for me because he like he likes me. He's a good pipe fitter. So I won't be my knees. Once you put your four tags, you know, take it, take it, take it, take it, take it away. You know. You go all the all the way around. I did one pass, kinda like a root, and then one on top. As you can see here. <laughs> yep, 7018. We use a uh, 330 seconds. I use 330 second rod. 7018 at 90 amps. It was welding good. We're using the Lincoln Vintage 300 with the Kubota engine. And I'm saying this because as I get more experience and talk to welders and friends, you know, they said that different engines were different, you know. There's the Kubota engine, which is from Japan. And there's a Perkins engine. There's the Cat engine. Mitsubishi. You know, I don't... I I tried different ones, not all of them, but I'm just showing you guys, let you know, in case you were wondering. This was well with the Vintage 300 Lincoln with the Kubota engine. That's right. It looks perfect, 100%. I like it. And now we're gonna weld the inside with 7018 this time we only gonna do one pass that's right that's all you need it looks perfect 100 percent i like it clean with your wire wheel make sure you clean the inside good and also the where the gasket is gonna go and just if you got some sparks you know or you burn a little bit like I did right here and that's it you know that's it for the sleep on flanges pretty easy and now that now that I'm over here back in Texas in this little town I'm gonna I did it before I'm gonna ask you guys if you wanna donate to Red Cross or anything you wanna do to help victims of this Hurricane Harvey you can you can if you can do it if you don't want to you don't you don't have to but thank you again if you already did have a good night